How I made a 45% return in the stock market in the last month. What is happening investors? It is your boy Jack. I am not a financial advisor and no, that title is not clickbait whatsoever. Across the last month or so, slightly more, I have bought five different companies and we're going to go through all of them today when I bought how much of them I bought and how much they have gone up since. And you will see that the total gain is at about 45% across the span of a month. Considering the last stock we bought was only literally a couple of days ago and it hasn't really done anything, that's decent. Now that 45% gain is only attributed to these new companies. Oh, so your portfolio probably only went up 3%. My overall gain for the month is currently at about 31, 32%. So, the entire portfolio didn't go up 45%, but in the last month, that's what our new investments have made us. Now, the reason I'm making this video is because I know there's been a lot of selling off as of late, and there's been a lot of upset people, a lot of people who have bought at the tops, don't have patience, who have been selling at losses. A lot of people like to blame me for their incompetence. It is what it is. But I just want to show you guys how I'm actually performing, and I mean, everybody in the Patreon knows this. So that's the first thing I want to say in today's video. If you want to get updated, Every single time I buy or sell a stock, hit the first link in the description and sign up to my Patreon. You will get full access to my private Discord group where you get my buy and sell alerts and you also get access to 40 plus private related channels. And you also join a community of over 550 patrons who all share more information than I possibly could together. It's an incredible community. And if you had have bought everything I had have bought, you're up over 45% right now. So right before we do get into the video where we speak about everything I have bought, please my friends, can I ask you to hit that juicy like button? I know I don't share my exact positions as much as I used to so if you want me to start doing that more you know blow this video up drop me a comment down below let me know how you've done over this last month I know it has been a really good month and please if you are indeed new around here hit that juicy red subscribe button make some money with me make some money with the family my friends and also if you want four free stocks two of which are valued up to $1,600 hit the second link in the description sign up to Weibull and deposit $100 it's that simple. So the first company I bought is on the screen right now. It's a favourite on the channel. It is Lordstown Motors. Now this technically wasn't last month as it was the 28th of October, but I wanted to include them. So I bought them right back here when they were 14.40 a share and I bought 90 shares. Now prior to this, I already owned 210 shares in the company. So this was fantastic for me. I got two dollar cost average down in a company that I love. And now my cost basis is actually at 16.44. Now this is a company I I have a lot of experience with. I bought them the first day we found out about them at $11 a share. I even bought them in the 20s, but I was really happy to buy at this 1440 mark. So all in all, I spent about $1,296 on this company back then. And as of recording this video, those shares are worth just over $2,050. So a nice gain there. But I really do want to use this company as an example because this just shows how important patience and conviction really is. I mean, keep in mind, guys, I bought them at 1440. These guys were up in the 30s at one stage, the 31s. And I was very happy to see them up there. And ultimately, we went through this prolonged downward movement. And a lot of people were saying to me, you you must not believe in this company. You're not buying more at 21. You're not buying more in the 17s, 18s. But it was patience. And it paid off. I got to buy my shares at 1440. I got to make it around 300 shares. Patience can be very important in the stock market, my friends. So that's the first one. I mean, in a short period of time, we've seen a really, really nice return there. The 5th of November, I decided to buy some more ChargePoint. Again, a company I already was in, but you'll see I bought 50 more shares at 15.50 a share. I mean, they're all up over 100%. They were up even higher. They were up, look, all the way in the 42s. We made a lot of money here. And what's nice about this is my cost basis is actually still in the low 14. So this wasn't even dollar cost averaging down. I paid a little bit more, but I got a bigger position. So this was one where I really started to see some bullish momentum picking up. There started to be a lot more good news. There was a lot more hype surrounding the company. And I decided, you know, in that moment of time, it's time to buy a little bit more in this company. And it's paid off. So that's up over 100% since we bought those additional shares. And I know a lot of people did buy this one with me. A lot of you guys got involved. Now, obviously, there's been quite a considerable pullback from the top. But there has been with a lot of these EV companies. And if you guys follow the channel, remember, I put out a community post a while ago speaking about SPACs and EV SPACs in particular, saying that I simply put, thought they were overvalued. So, you know, if I had have recorded this video maybe a week earlier, I would have been up a whole lot more, but this is more realistic representation. But again, guys, this was one where, you know, patience was an okay thing to have. There was no rush. We we were trading very sideways. We had some ups, we had some downs. 
I didn't need to rush into it. And then I, I had enough time to build up some conviction. I bought some more shares. We've made some juicy profits. The 16th of November, I bought 50 shares of Palantir. So quite clearly a very small position for me. And I bought them at 15.64 a share. So again, obviously right now, we're up very nicely. And again, this is a position where we were up over 100% in at the very peaks in a very short period of time. But like we've seen with a lot of these stocks, we've came back down a little bit. You know, there's some sort of consolidation going on. But again, very happy. Now, it's a very small position. So, you know, I wish I had to pull the trigger a little bit harder. I didn't. And here is actually a sneak preview of what you will see in the Patreon. I sent in there. Just bought 50 shares of Palantir. A relatively small initial purchase for me, but my mind isn't made up on what I believe will happen short term with this company. And I don't just mean this week, I mean the next couple of months. I opened the position as a feeler, but could see myself getting up to 150, 200 shares all going well. Now obviously, they've ran away on me. And I'm gonna tell you guys now, I haven't bought anything else since. But again guys, this is me playing the patience game, you know? Either I'm going to get to buy more at a price I'm happy to pay for, or else I'm going to get some really cheap shares in a company that I really like. But what I said in this Discord message to my patrons still stands. I still am not 100% sure what I think is going to happen short term. This bullish movement, I mean, yeah, it's awesome to see. I got in these guys and straight away I had made loads of money, but an awful lot of the market is overbought right now. So it's kind of a weird position to be in. Of course I'm happy that I'm making money, but I would very heavily welcome a considerable pullback here. So we invested $782 into the company, and now those shares are worth about $1,200 and $30. Now we have a rival. What a crazy journey it has been with this company. Absolutely crazy. The 18th of November, I bought in right here. I bought 100 shares at $13.13. Now again, I'm going to let you guys in on some insider information in regards to my Discord. I planned on holding 300 to 500 shares of this company. The reason I made a very small initial purchase was because I thought a move like this was going to happen or I thought a big pullback was going to happen. Now we just got news that Jim Cramer said that he basically thinks this is an amazing company so it's looking like we're going to be seeing some more upwards price action for a while. But again, we bought these guys at 13. I mean, these guys went all the way up to $33 a share very quickly in a span of a few days. And now even after this pullback, pre-market was sitting at about $26.80 a share. We're still up over 100% in the company. So I put in about $1,311. I mean, they're at $26.79 pre-market. Now that's worth $2,679. When I actually was writing out my numbers for this, they were only at $26.30. So we even made a little bit more than 45 percent this month so 100 shares you know it's an okay opening position for me but i really do have quite a bit of conviction on this company as a long-term investment but again i think the short term is a little bit choppy and i'm not going to be upset if we do see another pullback especially since there's going to be a bit of a gap here jim kramer has essentially pumped them up we'll have to wait and see what happens and the last company i bought was the 30th of november and it was vgac so i bought these guys at ten dollars 62 cents a share right now you can see they're at about 10 40 a share so we're actually down a very small amount here. So I bought 300 shares, which equates to about $3,168. We're down about, I think, $20 or $30. But if you watch the video I put out on these guys, I don't really expect them to do anything for a while. They're a SPAC who does not yet have a merger target. I just somewhat see it as dead money in all honesty. But the thing is, I am really, really cash heavy right now. And cash is dead money anyway at the end of the day. So why not put a little bit into here? I have a 60 cent maximum loss on each share that I own. You know, worst case scenario, we lose a couple hundred dollars. It's okay. Best case, we could make literally thousands and thousands. So weirdly enough, I still see this just as, as cash. I see this as money almost in a savings account. So over the last month, I've put a total of about $7,314 into the market. And as of right now, I'm at about $10,661 in those positions, equating to about a 45% gain. And that's how we did it, guys. Patience. There were so many other companies I could have invested in. So many that we've spoken about on this channel. But I really don't throw myself at every opportunity I see. And again, I've been preaching patience on the channel so much lately, especially because I know we speak about growth stocks, we speak about EV stocks, we speak about speculative stocks, we speak about highly volatile stocks. I still try to treat them as long-term investments, okay? And I still try to look at them all and evaluate them all with patience in the back of my mind. I try not to rush into things. And I mean, this month in particular, it's paid off very handsomely. These positions are up 45%. The overall portfolio is up over 31%. It's been fantastic. But if you take anything away from this video, 
just know that patience is a good thing. And also know that guys, this isn't going to be a typical month, like without a doubt in my mind. And in fact, since this month was so good, I would expect a relatively poor month. Maybe we'll go up in the green a little bit, maybe we'll make some good new investments, but hopefully we'll get some opportunities to dollar cost average down a little bit. I would welcome pullbacks on a lot of the companies I've already bought, because they've run away so quickly. But anyway my friends, that was just a little update video on, you know, how we had a good month in the market. If you enjoyed and, you know, you would like to see more videos like this one, please hit that like button, drop me a comment down below and of course subscribe if you're new around here. Again my friends, if you are interested in that Patreon group, hit that first link in the description. You will not regret it my friends. And if you want your free stocks, sign up to Weeble, that's the second link in the description. Deposit $100, two of them are valued up to $1600. It's literal free money. Thank you all so much for watching. If you've stayed all the way till the end, you, my friend, are a true legend. I hope you have an absolutely fantastic day. I will see you for another video very soon. Peace.